managerial accounting, calculating applied manufacturing overhead. Now, once we have come up with the predetermined manufacturing overhead rate at the beginning of the period, well, the next thing that happens is that as we work on jobs, we start to apply manufacturing overhead to the cost of those jobs. And the calculation is pretty simple. We, we can't take that predetermined overhead rate and multiply that rate times the actual activity base or the actual number of direct labor hours used on that job or the actual number of machine hours used on that job. Whatever the base is, we multiply the rate times the actual amount of that base that is consumed by that individual job. And that, of course, is going to yield the amount of applied manufacturing overhead that is charged to the job cost sheet and also to the work in process inventory account where those various job costs are being accumulated. Now, let's take an example. Building on the example that we started in the previous exercise, Remember that our rate is $25 per machine hour. Now, let's say that we've got a job that has consumed during the current period 30 machine hours. So to calculate the amount of overhead applied to that particular job, we simply take that $25 rate per machine hour and multiply it times those 30 machine hours and that is going to yield a total of $750 that is applied to the jobs work in process account or the job cost sheet for that particular job. So pretty simple, rate times the actual activity consumed by individual jobs will equal the amount of overhead applied to the job cost sheet for that particular job and in turn to work and process inventory.